It is a chorus of clocks, a constant sound surrounding you inside Ye Old Clock and Gift Shop in Dallas. Reminders about the passage of time are, of course, everywhere you look here, too, in a place that has sold clocks for 55 years. All of these clocks are fascinating and have a story. Owner Tom Quinn has been part of the store for four decades. It's a link to the past. In a fast-paced world, these clocks are generational. They're made to last. And it's a store that has lasted into a world where now many of us just look at our phones to check the time. Nobody really cares about a lot of family heirlooms anymore, but the clocks are great family heirlooms that you can pass from generation to generation because they tick, they tell time, they chime. It's kind of like a, a link to the past. <laughs> The sound of a clock can bring instant memories. Adults thinking back to hearing certain chimes at their grandparents' house. One challenge Tom loves about his store is clock repair. He just finished fixing this one dating back to the 1800s. This is the same sound that his great grandparents listened to. And they took care of it and they set the time in the same fashion. Clocks are the heart of what makes this store tick. But while it's a gallery of telling time, it's also an exhibit place for local artists. These are my mosaic wine bottle lights. They are made with um, stained glass. Jenna Capral is one of dozens selling their work here. I sell a lot of stuff here. Yeah, more than anywhere that I've had my stuff before. It sells great here. We love local people that make things that are creative, and this area is rich with local creativity. The art stands out among so many clocks, but the variety of clocks proves they are a form of artwork too. This is a showplace for all of it, standing the test of time. John Meyer, Newswatch 16, on the Pennsylvania Road in Luzerne County.